And welcome back to the long run where we are playing Spyro 3, Year of the Dragon Reignited. So last time Hunter fell into a trap because he's a genius. Uh, this time we're hopefully going to rescue him, but first we're going to get to the fireworks factory. I'm pretty sure this is actually a Simpsons reference. Oh, I recognize you from the first, from the second game. Oh, hello. It's good to see you again, Spyro. That naughty sorceress has stolen the professor's rocket plans, and I'm on a secret mission to find them. Handel was supposed to meet me here, but I can't find him anywhere. Maybe you could help. I feel like he's always getting stuck somewhere. Oh, the ninjas come back. Interesting. I forgot about that. <laughs> All right. Get long and fool. Also, I didn't realize that I had uh, eaten the firework there. And nothing remained. Noodles. <laughs> Trent has, condi has conditioned you to oo. What has this world come to? So I'm guessing I could have probably used that firework to uh, destroy that strong box. Is there another firework around here? <laughs> also, it's great how I can just goad these ninjas to jump into the lava. That did indeed work. It's weird that, uh, so some of these appear to not come back? Well, how do I know which ones are which? Because the ones that don't come back have gems. Not really sure why you're firing at the wall there, but that's uh, fine with me, I guess. 
you'll have to use this cannon to get across here. Simply climb aboard. As for me, I just have to free my mind. Uh huh. I, I, I don't think that's how physics works. Just saying. I don't have a degree in physics, but uh. Second there, I thought that uh, Zoe had something, something to say. thing that this uh, firework keeps coming back. Am I gonna hit? It is gonna hit. Also, I'm guessing that the uh, the extra ninjas are probably coming from those boxes of ninjas that are just lying about. I think I can see an egg behind you, but it's out of reach. You'll have to take the long way around through these Rhinox to get to it. Okay, Handel doesn't have the, the speech impediment, so I don't know what was going on there. Yikes. Ow! No! Ah. I bet you I have to come back for you. With like the firework. Probably the intended way to deal with you. Where was that? Uh... I definitely don't have one in my mouth. Where was that firework? Or was there just one and it doesn't respawn? Because if there was just one and it doesn't respawn, I'm gonna have a hard time against this guy. Well, I guess it's not impossible. Ow! Ah! No, I didn't even hit him. Yep. Mm. Okay, that was me being impatient. I think I can. Yeah, I can. I know.
Wait, there it is. Ah, it does respawn. Maybe I just completely missed it. Wouldn't surprise me, honestly. And Sparks is pointing to the exit portal. Remember kids, if ever you see a box of ninjas, make sure you destroy it. Oh, I know what's coming up. We'll have to use this combo power up to take out these fire dragons. It will allow you to super fly and super clean at the same time. So these guys are kind of super annoying. Because if you're not on them... If you're not like super on them and just completely on the offensive all of the time... They're just going to regenerate. And the fact is, like, they move a lot faster than you. So if they go into one of the tunnels, like, you have no chance of actually doing any damage. Get out of the way, Handle. Like, they don't regenerate super fast, but the fact that they do it all is just kind of awful. Come on.
Well, I think if you get a hit off on them, it does reset their regen timer. I could be wrong, but I think it does. of the green one at the very least. Oh my goodness. Can you please stop tunneling? And like, part of the problem is, as you can see, the smaller they are, the harder they are to hit, and also the harder they are to kind of spot. I have completely lost the green one. There it is. There we go. Okay, one down. Where is the other one? Just r repeatedly tunneling is kind of not great. Oh my goodness. Oh, f are you freaking serious? And since this. N since this is not actually a flight stage, I can't do maneuvers.
thought for sure you were going to tunnel. Where are you? Like, at the very least, they're... Like, it's predictable that if they go into one tunnel, they're going to come out of the other end of that tunnel. They're not going to turn around in the middle of the tunnel and come out the same end. Where are you? Like, seriously, where are you? Are you, like, behind me or something? Sorry for anyone who's having some motion sickness issues with this. I'm getting pretty sick too. Sick of this damn dragon. They might turn around and go back into the same tunnel, but they're never going to just turn around in mid-tunnel. Evan, Evan Almighty. Yeah, me too, thanks. Anyway, let's clean out the gems in this area. And preferably not die in the process, holy crap. Apparently there are no gems here. I do appreciate how many whirlwinds there are. But I think in the original, the um the power-up gate was also not semi-permanent like it is here. Like, it had a timer. So just making this even worse.
Is that the last one? Yep. Let's get out of here. Also another cannon. Is this where we started? It still amuses me the fact that I can just make them drop in lava. I don't know if I can follow you that closely though. Well, I see a sign there. Um, wait, no, that. Well, I'll rip that egg, I guess. I don't see why they would put it into orbit. The entire point of the fact that they have the eggs. Tell him I've gone back to Evening Lake to finish work on the professor's walk-in. The, the entire point of getting the eggs is to actually restore magic to this part of the world. Why would you send an egg into orbit? that door to a monkey's area of some kind, which appears to be where the rest of the gems are. So I guess let's go and go ahead and take the return on board. Well, we didn't get all of the gems, but at least we have a nice 25 at the end. be hungry. Thanks. Did you bring any chips? I'm sorry this happened, but I tried to warn you. I had to help Spyro rescue the eggs. You just don't understand. If we don't bring dragons back to this world soon, all our magic will be lost. The dragons used to live here? Yes, this was their original home. But a long, long time ago, the sorceress banished them to the other side of the world. She didn't realize the dragons were the source of all our magic. Maybe I could convince the dragons to come back, if you let me go. I'm sorry. I can't.
I, I don't think Hunter is really capable of convincing anyone of anything. It would have been easier to talk to them instead of kidnapping eggs. I don't think they would have moved back because, uh, you know, they were banished to the other side of the world. It's like, we made a new home, why should we come back? You be careful around these parts, little dragon. There be more ghosts in this here shipyard than I can shake my pick at. Darn shame, too, because I was mighty close to finding my treasure. Okay. And there is plenty of treasure all around here. I don't know if you can see. Also interesting that the theme here is a variation of uh, Sheila's theme. I reckon my treasure be this way, but we'll have to blast through this blooming ship to get to it. Well, how are we gonna? Oh, of course there's a cannon. Why wouldn't there be? Now, what else can I blast with this? Blast you. I'm having an awful hard time blasting anything. There we go. I realized I could just get out of my cannon and just charge them or flame them, but this is more fun. There we go. I am going to have to canonize these uh, birds, though. Like, can I not do that? Like, are they too high up? Huh. I can get that one. I don't think I can get the other one. See, it kind of comes down when uh, when it's in the back there. Maybe I can hit it back there. Now, well, there's probably another way to hit it. Really? <laughs> it doesn't seem slippery, but I guess it is, so we're left with the, the eternal, you know, age-old question, how do I get up there? Also, why is the water literally acid? Like, what happened to the ecosystem of this area that caused the water to turn into acid? Really? Yeah, 
That looks like maybe progress. I don't think I have anywhere else to go, so... Okay, you died. I imagine this type of game just randomly throw that message. Yeah, pretty sure this type of game just kind of creates environments and then doesn't ask questions. Get all these birds. Like some of these just don't look very hittable at all. that one go. It's definitely flying overhead. Oh, it was turning that way. Maybe I just do not understand the migratory patterns of these birds. Okay, well... <laughs> Spyro, get out of the can and, and reset your damn camera. What the hell? Also, I'm seeing some gems down there. How is that gonna work? Some fool hid a dead gum egg in my treasure. Hmm, I wonder which fool that is. Craig, can you provide me with a list of fools? That's how we don't end up on the list of correct made of all the fools. That one. Hmm. One over there too. Didn't get that one yet. Hey, 
area. I don't see any more birds. I think we might have got them all. I do remember seeing a strong box over there. I don't know if we got it. Oh, the strong box is over there. My bad. I don't think I hit it. Probably hit it, right? Nope. <laughs> hmm. It definitely looks like something that I need to hit with a cannon, too. Maybe I need to hit it with this cannon. And a different angle on it. There we go. going. Okay, that was the way, yeah, over here. And I can go over here. Okay. Trying to remember how to navigate these stages sometimes is uh, the real challenge. That's how we get over here. Man, so many crabs. I feel like I've probably already made a deceased crab joke in this uh, in this playthrough, so I shall just allude to it and not actually make one. Huzzah! <laughs> Dagnabbit! Bank sale! Right. Well... I see skateboards. That implies Hunter. Hunter ain't here. Aw, oh, poor little dragon. Did your friend go bye-bye? Now, now, don't worry. You'll soon be joining him. The sorceress. It's 
So yeah, unfortunately, um, can't really do anything because apparently you can skateboard up these hills, but you can't run up these hills. So weird how that works. Source just draws really well. Oh, uh, perhaps. Could also be that the sorceress draws like crap and asked um, asked Bianca to uh, draw that for her. And by asked, I mean ordered. So now for this perilous trek. Fortunately, you're never really far from uh, a spot of like land to get off on. Just sometimes that might happen. <laughs> God damn it. Anyway, I saw another um, another zone portal somewhere around here. And I think you can also get to another one through these acid tunnels. I just don't remember exactly how you get there. Or maybe I'm thinking of another stage. Ah, uh, no, that's just, uh... Uh, this stage has definitely returned to crab. That was a weird way I was sliding there. Down? Oh, there's still some in the in the acid. Great. Okay, I think those were the last gems in the main area, and there is one more, uh, one more side portal to go into. I realize I keep calling them something different every time.
These here waters used to be my favorite diving spot, but I can't get any loot with these subs patrolling around. Think you can pilot this here sub I bought for scrap? Uh, I guess. Alrighty then. Press the jump button to speed on up, and when you get a sub in your sights, the torpedo will start to lock on. If you get a good lock on, fire away with the attack button. Okie dokie. So now here's the thing. You don't necessarily have to get a lock on. If you can get a good shot on someone. Then uh, you can still get him down without locking on. The lock on just tends to make things easier. And not every time either. Some mean sub driving skills. Why don't you have this here egg as a reward? As a reward? Hey, it's silver code Ethel. Hmm. Not the same Ethel I remember. Well, I hate to ask your help again. There'll be even more subs that don't come out of nowhere. Of course. Them, I could use this acid lake as my swimming hole again. Darn tootin'. Get on, little dragon. Excuse me, using this acid lake as your swimming hole? Is that what you just said? Anyway, something that we're probably going to want to do is make sure that everything that can be broken is broken. Now, there is the slight problem that we can't collect gems while we're in the sub. So we're gonna have to go out here without the sub and just using the power of the invincibility. Also, the thing with the lock-on is it doesn't guarantee that this shot will hit. And these subs are incredibly maneuverable. So they can juke your missiles if they really try. Swimming again. Uh, is it? Reward you better, but all I got left is this here other egg. Maybe there'll be something better in this one. Dolores. <laughs> anyway, it's time to take an acid bath. All right. Maybe it's a real mild acid. Maybe it is. So I think it goes without saying, if you let the uh, shield gauge run out, Spyro instantly dies.
And that is true, Spyro did used to be water soluble. And at the very least, now he's learned to swim. And... Ooh. I think that's all of them. Yep. Which I believe should mean that the remaining gems are all going to be in the skate park. Oh no, there is a gem in- uh, there is a, an egg in the acid. So the remaining gems are probably going to be in the skate park. Or maybe. I don't know. The fact is, we're going to have to come back. But let's try to get as much as we can. Where are you pointing me? Right, you're pointing me to the remaining gems, which are in the skate park, like I was saying. Unfortunately, you do not know how to point me to an egg. Here it is. Chad. I guess there was a couple of gems left here. Hmm. There's still gems here? Yeah, Sparks is definitely not pointing to the uh, to the zone portal there. Oh. <laughs> Please do not, sir. And then sir proceeded to do twice. I still suspect that there are gems somewhere around here. I 
I don't know where you're pointing, Sparks. And I'm gonna have to come back here anyway, so we'll deal with it later. Maybe if I didn't have to wade through friggin' acid. It. I guess this hunk of junk is supposed to fly. Oh, sure glad I ain't the one getting on. Thanks for the vote of confidence. You have nothing to say, sir? Sir? Okay. Well, uh,. That means that there's only one last thing, well, other than the spark stage. There's only one thing that I haven't done yet. That's Honey Speedway. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, I don't know why that's relevant. Uh -huh. I threw the honeycombs, the beehives. That's only three things. I missed one. Oh, which one did I miss? How do I know? Well, I missed one there, that's for damn sure. Oh, may as well start over. Fall into the deadly, deadly honey. I have enough time to come back to it, but I don't think I will. Well, maybe. It won't be pretty, but... Uh... Maybe if I hadn't turned there, 
because I was uncertain. Provided that I don't miss in here, or that I only miss one at the very end, I should add this this time. There we go. That wasn't so bad. Unfortunately, I gotta race the bumblebees. Really? Okay, I guess I can't charge into that. I definitely got that sense, Terry. I like the concept, I just think the execution could have used some work. At least it's not like in the original, because I don't think this game has dynamic difficulty like the original did. And the, dy the dynamic difficulty really made things super annoying. No! Frickin' hell! I don't know why he got turned around like that. And then I, I... I can't charge through that, apparently. I charge through it the second time. I don't know why it doesn't work most of the time. You know what? Never mind the rocket. Just go.
Okay, I don't think it's worth trying to run through that, honestly. Either don't run through it, or just don't take the rocket. Because the problem is, I can't charge through the rockets. I don't know why. Well, that's a lot of time lost. Just have to not screw up majorly, and I got it. I got this backup rocket just in case uh, somebody decides to overtake me. Don't get a point of dynamic difficulty, kind of feel like like in this type of game is just punishing the player for doing well. Yeah, more or less. The dumblebees? Henri! Exit the level, but uh, we gotta go find Hunter. Now where is Hunter? I feel like he should be around like this construct here, but I don't know. I'm not seeing a way into it. Pretty much just gotta look for like conspicuous places. <laughs> I 
Why yes, Sparks, I, I agree that the dragons should donate all of their hoard to charity. <laughs> oh, where are you, Hunter? Would be nice if uh, Sparks followed you into this, uh, like, once you once you got the 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 egg for doing the speed thing oh you're right hunter is in the box hunter won't be here because he's not available right now thank you for reminding me jerry and i would have been looking for like 20 minutes Okay. Um all right, this is this is the area that I can't actually get anywhere from. So let's head over to Midnight Mountain. Surely there won't be another boss in our way. That seems too obvious. Oh. <laughs> Spin! That's it! I've had enough! I'm going to create a monster to end all monsters! <laughs> And I'm going to send it out to destroy all the dragons, even the little hatchlings. Yes, yes, it will smash them and crush them and grind them and tear them. Oh, yes, smear them and smush them and crack them and crease them. Let me out of here, you. But uh, won't that kill them? <laughs> it doesn't matter as long as I can still collect their wings. What? All this time you've only wanted them for their wings? Of course, you ignorant girl! I need them for a spell so I can live forever! Uh, wait a second. A, a spell? What did you think I was going to do with all those dragons? Open a zoo? <laughs> Ooh, if I had my blaster, you'd be singing a different tune! You know what I mean? You said just keeping them in our world was enough. You never said you had to kill them. I don't have to kill them. It just stops them from wriggling so much. You're terrible. I can't believe I ever listened to you. Stupid, insolent brat. I'll take care of her as soon as I finish off that dragon. Now, where was I? Ah, yes. <laughs> Now, this is gonna get real ugly. <laughs> Agent 9, you know you're not stuck in that cage, right? This might be our last stand, Spyro. The sorceress plans to use this monster to destroy every iota of her opposition. Beginning with the two of us. Alas, there is no time for ruminating. A battle awaits us. I will endeavor to assist you by means of a steady provision of combustible projectiles. Rockets. Got it. Okay, this sign actually... Oh. It let me uh, move the camera until... Um, until everyone got into position. Anyway.
Not really sure what I ran into there, but okay. Not really sure how you're supposed to lead shots with the uh, with the red uh, muscles, but anyway, that was pretty easy. And here's James, not to be confused with Sergeant Bird. Time to defeat Man Bad. Na -na 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 -na. That. But now we actually get to enter Midnight Mountain for real. Hi, Bianca. Did you bring any more food? Oh, I'm starving. There's no time for that, Hunter. We have to stop the sorceress. <gasps> She's gonna kill all the dragon hatchlings. <gasps> Wait a minute. Why should I trust you? This could be another trap. You're in a cage, you furry numbskull. How can I trap you by letting you out? I don't know. You sorceress types can be sneaky. <sighs> I mean, let's be real. I thought we were going to hurt the dragons. Come on, we don't have time for this. <laughs> One, it's not hard to trick Hunter, and two, there have been plenty of plots where letting the captive go has been integral to, you know, the, the actual thing that is trying to get done. Well, I know you don't trust me, but I want to help you stop the sorceress. There's a way to open a hidden portal to her lair, but it'll take some very strong magic. If you can find more of the dragon eggs, I think my magic will be strong enough to open the portal. I'll come find you when you have enough eggs, okay? Yeah, how many are we talking? Because I got over a hundred now. It's a life-size space monkey action figure, complete with a action figure, you say. Laser. I'd love to let him out so you can play with him, but the sorceress seems to think he's a menace. Does she? I wonder why. <laughs> You've always had a weakness for helping silly little creatures, haven't you, Spyro? Sure, that's what it is. I suppose there couldn't be any harm in letting him out, could there? <laughs> there has been harm every single time, you absolute buffoon. Thanks, Spyro. Ooh, say, you ever see a fair dance? <laughs> uh, no? <laughs> well, it's your lucky day! Check this out. Quite <laughs> a dancer, isn't he? Not much stamina, though. Too bad I had a lot more ammo left. <laughs> Anyway, I heard all about how you've been fighting the sorceress and her armies and kicking all that butt, and I just wanted to say, huzzah, yippee, woohoo! Wish you could stay, but my homeworld's been overrun by a Rhinox since I've been captured. If you happen to see the sorceress, tell her I'll be giving her dancing lessons real soon. Know what I mean? You bet. Later! <laughs> well, he certainly is energetic.
Was that a blue butterfly? Yeah, it sure was. Son of a bitch! Not quite. Almost. <sighs> I think I lost ground there. There we go. I mean, Agent 9 doesn't seem like he's quite all there, for, for sure, but, um... At least he looks like he's on our side, so at least there's that. Haunted Tomb. Hmm. I wonder if we'll get to see a Lara Croft parody there. Let's see. We're going to have to check that stage out next time, though. For now, let's just focus on trying to clear this. Trying to burp a, burp a, bu a butterfly. Yeah, I'm not really sure where, where that butterfly came from. Let's be real. Well, this looks like an ominous place, and hey, a hundred eggs, you say? You found enough dragon eggs for me to unlock the portal. Once I've opened it, you can confront the sorceress whenever you're ready. But be careful; she'll be expecting you. Yeah, she probably will. Actually, what do you think, Evie? Should I just go fight the sorceress now? Yeah, let's leave her for last. I was legit thinking of doing it, but uh, decided, yeah. Guessing behind this portal. Yeah, sure enough. Well, here's a spark stage. I feel like there's supposed to be a uh, whirlwind here. Here's our final speedway of the series. Get down, get down, and move it all around. Boom! Hey there, buddy.
Hmm. Well, this... Stop that. This seems like a very, um, conspicuous door. There's some stuff back there. How do we get back there? Oh, I see some stairs. Yeah, okay. all the gems. That's not all the eggs. It's a secret and one other egg on top of that. I think what I'm gonna do to finish off, uh, not go to Scorch's Pit, but I'm gonna go back to Evening Lake and we're gonna finish off with the Spark stage. Which I think is up here. showed me a place called Starfish Reef. She said there's an egg hidden in there. I think Sparks should check it out. I think so too. Oh jeez. Oh dear. Oh yes, unfortunately... Uh, the bubble around us is not a measure of protection. It is a measure of not drowning. sure why those guys didn't mobilize, but you know, it works for me. Oh my goodness.
Ah, no. Press the correct button. My goodness. This uh, area feels very Smash TV like. Which actually reminds me, I think. Um, I think the festivities for uh, the 2023. Smash TV Easy Mode Tournament are about to start. Hey Zero, how you doing? Oh yes, Smash TV. Good luck! You'll need it! Unfortunately, you're joining me for like the last thing I'm doing today. A little bit like Johnny in that respect. Working here since the two flying dragons part. Okay. Fixing some Windows update stuff. That's never fun. I'm sorry you have to deal with that because that is definitely a pain in the face. Anashan. I have definitely had it that uh, my w my Windows update was so messed up that I actually had to just like basically I my Windows update was messed up. I tried to fix it and broke it so hard that I had I just had to reinstall Windows, and that that was just before I um, got this new computer set up. It's like I was trying to avoid exactly what ended up happening. And yes, those dragons were extremely annoying. <laughs> well, we didn't get the notification that we got all the gems. And this area is mostly pretty linear, so I don't really know where I missed one. Ah, here we go. A whole five gems, Tyrion. When I saw that giant stingray, I thought you were a goner, Sparks. But you sure showed him. And now the yeah, it just kind of blasted him in the face. Even stronger, allowing you to take one more hit for Spyro. So that's where I get the extra point of health. I thought I got the extra point of health from the second one, but I guess not. Anyway, back to back to Midnight Mountain. I almost said more on Mountain. That's something else entirely.
But we are getting pretty close to the end. And I think I can actually confidently say this time that next time we're going to be finishing the game. Um, I thought we were going to be finishing the game today, but then turns out I had a lot more to do than I thought. By the way, now that I recall, what we end up getting from this, uh, from this Sparks power-up is kind of, uh, not particularly useful. You know what Fi says, I'm discounting on you. <laughs> Such a good line. I should get some more emotes. I I think because the the artist that I got those emotes from uh, basically you can get like a single one, you can get a three pack, or you can get a seven pack. And I think I have seven slots available between my follower emotes and my uh, tier one subscriber. I should look into that. I just don't really know what I would do for for some of them right now. Anyway. So that is, in fact, going to do it for today's stream. So Thank y'all for uh, watching. Thank you to uh, Tyrion and Zero for hanging out. Uh, the next scheduled stream, of course, is going to be on Sunday at nine, uh, no, at eight p.m. or later, Atlantic Standard Time. It is the Sunday Super Shuffle. We're gonna do some Sunday Super Shuffle stuff. Probably Archipelago. <laughs> it usually is, like ninety-nine percent of the time. And that takes us around the week, around the wheel, to our next uh, long run stream next Tuesday at 9 p.m. where hopefully we can actually finish this game because uh, I thought we were starting Chrono Trigger next week and clearly we're not. Uh, so yeah. Uh, I'm probably, I, I might do a programming stream on the other channel tomorrow. But I do know I still have a few things to work on. But, uh, if you're interested, you can go check that out at, uh, picarto.tv slash felicitousneko, F-E-L-I-C-I-T-U-S-N-E-K-O. Um, and yeah. So that's gonna do it. Thank y'all for watching. I'm cool here if you don't know. I'll see you guys next time. And sorry about me just hitting my desk just now. <laughs>